talking about Philippines folk dances today on Cabo Bayan LA with members of Sampaguita Youth uh, Dance Troupe. We have Nina and Regina. Uh, when we talk about Philippine folk dances, there's different uh, kinds of dances, mm -hmm. right? From the different regions and then different uh, time periods of the Philippines, correct? Mm -hmm. Am I correct? Uh, what are those? Can you remember some? Well, traditional ones that we have done are um, we do Igorot mm -hmm. and then we do Spanish, mm -hmm. Muslim, and rural. And recently, our last concert, we did Lumad. Lumad, yeah. Okay. And, and what does that, what did that have? That had like more of the, um, how do I say, kind of by the mountain. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, I get it. So Igorot is, is a kind of like a by the mountains, right? Yeah, oh? that is yes. too. Okay, Lumad. And what about this concert? What is going to be different in this concert? Well, the first part of our concert, it's more talking about us as a dance troupe. Mm -hmm. And then the second part shows where we got our name, the Sampaguita. Mm -hmm. And then the third part is where we actually do the cultural dances, but we have a little bit of a twist. We use a little bit more modernized music, mm -hmm. and some of our moves are a little modernized, but still keeping the traditional moves. I imagine it takes a lot of dedication because to learn all those, and each style is different, each style is unique, mm -hmm. you, it takes a lot of practice, no? Mm -hmm. How much time uh, do you, uh, how, how many times in a week do you practice, how many hours? Um, well, for this upcoming concert, uh, we practice probably uh, Saturday and Sunday, mm -hmm. and at least probably, I would say, eight hours each day. So you must really love what, what you're doing, mm -hmm. right? To be able to practice Saturday and Sunday, yeah. <laughs> eight hours, my gosh. Yeah. Um, is there a favorite genre of Philippine folk dance that, you're, that, that's your, that you like? My favorite is Spanish. Oh, okay. It has the really nice dresses, right. really colorful, mm -hmm. and it's very elegant. And that's why it's my favorite. Are we going to be seeing uh, any of those at yes. the upcoming concert? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What about you? What's your favorite? Um, actually, my favorite is Spanish too. Spanish yeah, too. Yeah, I love the control, um, the character we get to play mm -hmm. um, when we dance. I love that you can be joyful in the mu with the music. You can smile. Yeah, <laughs> but you can also be serious. Right. So. Right. Okay. Um, so go ahead. Invite our viewers to your concert. So our concert is on February 3. It's at Long Beach City College at 5 p.m. Please come and support us. There are only 13 of us. We're all girls, so this is a very special concert, and we'd love to see all of you there. Anything special that we need to look out for at the concert? What's your favorite part of the concert? Um, I actually like all of it, but there is something new that we're doing. Mm -hmm. um, we've never done a dance play, uh -huh. and it's actually directed by one of our own. Uh -huh. um, her name is Rainil, and um, it tells the story of San Pagita and the flower, and actually how we grew up to be. Through dance? Through dance. Ooh, that's yeah. interesting. So are we going to see V Sing Vinasoan in this concert? Yes, um, no, maybe? We'll keep it a surprise. Yeah. Surprise. <laughs> but for now, they're going to give us a sneak peek of their Binasuan. You were smiling. You didn't look too nervous. There you sit. <laughs> There's no tape. It wasn't no, no. tape. It was no just tape. pure balance. Enjoy this one, guys. Thank you. Break a leg. Good luck on Thank your you. Time. Thank you for joining us today on the show. Have a great weekend. Everyone, here is a performance from Sampaguita Youth Dance Troupe.